Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Best of British Blackwell. Today, on this roasting hot day, where it's nearly 40 degrees, I am going to be doing something very different, which I did promise in my last uh, video. Uh, this is not a cooking video, this is a refurbishment exercise. So what are we going to be refurbishing? Well, let's turn the camera away from me because I'm a sweaty mess, and let's have a look at what we're going to be refurbishing. So here it is. This is a whiskey barrel cold, cold smoker. Um, I picked this up from um, a great guy on my Facebook page, uh, the Outdoor Grilling Smoking Barbecuing UK page, which I will uh, send a link to. I'll put a link down in the bottom of this video too. Uh, he picked this up and uh, he thought that he would be able to use this as a standard uh, barbecue. But obviously those that know, uh, we'll know that you know something wooden like this is not going to be able to hold the heat or flames of a standard grill and instead this uh, has been converted some time ago into a cold smoker and you can tell it's happened some time ago because this has obviously got a little bit of age to it there are some more modern features to it like um, the uh, thermostat uh, the, the the thermometer that's been put in there and the vent but to be honest with you, it's in need of a lot of loving care. So let's take um, a slightly closer look inside. There's a nice brass handle on here and it is heavy. This is a very well-constructed barrel. And hopefully you can see from inside there that this has been used as a smoker. You can see some of the patination on the, uh, on the wood there. I wonder if it was treated at any stage. And it's got a couple of uh, wire racks in there as well. Um, yeah, all very interesting so far. There's a little sign of some uh, heat damage at the bottom there. Um, and there's a nice big hinge on the back there which may need looking at. So let's close that down. I think the hinge is one of the things that needs looking at straight away because uh, it's not the easiest in the world to open so I wonder if we can rectify that and then obviously here we've got a little bit of a, um, an issue here where the barrel doesn't quite line up with the hinge and the top and um, not everything is kind of secure so I think the first job might be to just go around it and see where the issues are so like I said um, I think one of the first jobs is to look around this find uh, the issues, find where we think there are some issues and what we can do to kind of rectify those. Uh, but ultimately what I want to get to by the end of this little series of videos, and this will be a series, I want two things to happen. I want this to transform itself into, you know, an excellent cold smoking barrel. Uh, and then the other thing I want is you guys to get involved and try and help me out with this. Now, I am pretty good at your standard DIY. Um, you know, I can put up shelves and I can, you know, stick the IKEA furniture together. Um, but I haven't really attempted a restoration project like this ever before. And I'm going to need as much help as I can. So um, I'm going to be posting this video both on YouTube and Facebook. So it'd be excellent if you could just drop some comments below. Let me know uh, where you think you would start. Um, let me also know what type of uh, finish I should be looking for on this whether I should be sanding this down, should I seal it, should I wax it, should I varnish it? If you guys let me know what you think and just drop drop any comments and suggestions in the comments below, I'd really appreciate it. And this is gonna be the start of the project, uh, which I'm really looking forward to.